yourhaitiantranslator.com and today I will shoot a short video uh, to explain something to you that is important if you want to translate from English into Haitian Creole. So if you were to go on google.com and you were to type the following sentence, uh, query, free English to Haitian Creole translation, right? So we got this, right? You have, uh, these are the results from the search uh, engine that you get. You get the Google option itself, the Google Translate option itself right here, Google Translate, okay, right here, okay, as an option, that's the first option. Then the second option is translate.com, the third is lingvanex.com, the fourth is uh, online translation product of, uh, the fifth is translatees.com. All, all these options are not human based, they are all machine based. So you're, you're dealing with the with AI, uh, with the machine translator. Uh, this is what you're dealing with. So this is not human based, it's based on the machine and whatever else they, they're saying. Now, the purpose of this video is to see how accurate these uh, online translation tools can be for English to Haitian Creole. I understand that you know it depends on your purpose you know so we will be looking at a very simple sentence okay and we will see how each at least the first three options how they handle the translation how reliable how accurate of a translation they give back to you and if you can rely upon those translation tools for English to Haitian Creole when you need serious documents translated if you want a general idea it's one thing but if you want if it's a school document if any some if anything that is um, important in terms of communication can you use can you rely on those tools and be certain that translation you're getting is accurate so let's go with it let's go with the test let's type a very simple sentence we'll type the cicada was singing singing the whole day so i'm i'm testing google translate for this sentence right the cicada was singing the whole day now google returned to me cicada tap chante to junior now one thing is clear google translate does not know how to translate the word cicada from English into Haitian Creole. So nobody had, has, has put that word into the machine for Google. So Google Translate is incapable as, as of this video to translate correctly the word cicada. So they, pro they propose cicad. I am Haitian, born and raised. And I can guarantee you I have never I have never heard the word cicad as uh, meaning cicada. That, that word doesn't exist in Haitian Creole. The word that they should have used is cigal. S I G A L. Cigal, which comes which comes from the French la cigal. Okay. So right here, it is clear with just one sentence. I was able to show you that you can't rely on Google Translate itself for the correct translation from English into Haitian Creole. And the rest of the sentence is more or less okay, but this one word, because if you send this um, translation to a Haitian person, they'll be scratching their heads and wondering, what is Sikad? I've never heard this word before. Is that a new word? No, it's a word that Google Translate invented. It doesn't exist in Haitian Creole. So we have to be careful when you're using those free translation softwares if you want something serious. If it's something, if it's a website, if it's an email message, you can't say that I'm gonna just input it into Google 
and I'm going to get a free drink. So yes, it can be free. Yes, it might convey the general ideas, but sometimes it can also end up with totally nonsensical things. And that will defeat the purpose of your effort because what is the point of sending a message in Haitian Creole if the message is inaccurate, if the message doesn't make sense? You are not communicating, you know? So that is for Google. Of course, uh, again, as I said, I'll be very clear. Can Google Translate be used for Haitian Creole for, to get a general idea for, for certain sentences or for certain words? Maybe yes. But can you rely upon Google? Can you trust Google Translate to give you the most accurate translation from English to Haitian Creole, as you can see in this one sentence, not a whole document, not a complex sentence, Google didn't have the word cicada in its memory, period. Now let's move on to the second option. Uh, the second option you have here is, is the website translate.com. I'm gonna click on it and you, I'm gonna input the same sentence and you're gonna see how this very famous website, this, very, this uh, well known website, what kind of job they're giving, what kind of translation they're doing for very simple sentence in Haitian Korea. They might be claiming they are extremely accurate. This is, this is marketing ploy, this is just talking. The, the, the proof is in the pudding. When you input the sentences, you get, you get to see the translation. Don't forget, I'm a Haitian person, I was born and raised in Haiti. I went to college in the States, I worked, uh, I worked in the States, okay, and for my communication, you can see how I'm speaking, I, I, I don't sound American, but I definitely have a good comment of the English language, that is for sure. So let's go to the uh, second option here, proposed on the Google search results, it's translate.com. So let's go here. So I'm gonna uh, right now I'm on translate.com. Okay, it was the sick, it was the first result after the Google tables. So we are on translate.com. They want me, they want to check, they want to, you know. Uh, so okay, so now let me go here. I'm not gonna approve anything. You see a lot of advertising. So clearly, this website, translate.com, is trying to make money from you know selling its space, which is perfectly fine, but this is also they also say translation. All right, never mind. Now, let's input the same sentence. The cicada was singing the whole day. What is, what are they offering here? So, now, okay, now you see transit.com made almost the same mistake, okay, of being unable to translate the word Cicada. So can you rely if if it's something as simple as that and they don't have it in their memory, okay? Uh, they might be claiming they always they are always updating this and this and that. No, here right here, uh, the word cicada was not translated. So if you send a message like this to a Haitian person, you would be wondering what do you mean by cicada? Because once again, the word cicada does not exist in Haitian Creole. In translate.com was unable to translate that one, that one word. Now imagine if you have a very complex document, a bit more technical document, uh, with more sentences, you can imagine how many mistakes you're gonna get. You know, um, some mistakes might not affect uh, too much the meaning, the meaning might be, might be conveyed, but some mistakes are, are fatal because they block the communication. You don't, you don't get the Haitian person doesn't understand what you're saying because the word used by the machine is not conveying anything in their in Haitian Creole. Let's go back to Google and then check out the, the second option. Okay, so this is the, the, the first one here. Okay, now let's look at Lingvalex. Okay, another popular option proposed on Google's website. Uh, right here uh, on, on Lane Vanex website, Ling Vanex website, they are, are making a claim. They're saying 
If you ask yourself, how accurate is the translation from English to Haitian Creole right here, the best the, the thing here, the answer is machine language technology is used to perform the translation. Okay, being honest. Our translation software is evolving daily and provides very accurate, very accurate. This is important because this is a claim that we're gonna, you know, we're gonna test, we're gonna put to the test in a few in a few in a few minutes. Uh, and provides very accurate English to Haitian translation. Now, if you only speak English and you believe this um, statement, okay, you will think that okay, this website is giving me actual accurate, correct, reliable translation. Now, as a Haitian Creole translator, I'm going to show you, okay, with a simple sentence that this statement of providing very accurate English to Haitian Creole translation is incorrect, is misleading because when you input certain words, when you input certain sentences, you don't get that very accurate uh, promise that they made. Let's go to the website. Once again, I'm going to put the same sentence. The cicada was singing the whole day. Okay, and let's go with here. We're going to go with translate. Okay, once again, they have this. Um, platform this oh my god this platform has the same issue they can't translate the word cicada from english to haitian creole so if they can't translate this word imagine how many others they might not be able to translate not only that uh, they also made another mistake here which is very you know thing is that they saying uh in the english version is the past continuous an action ongoing an ongoing action in the past was singing okay but here in their translation in Haitian Creole they say sing S E I N G so they didn't even convey the past continuous in Haitian Creole so prior to going to their web page you you read with me they claim that they provide a very accurate English to Haitian Creole translation, but right here, okay, the proof is in the pudding. Right here, you can see that their machine translation software was unable to translate the word cicada. Very simple in Haitian. If you're Haitian, you've heard the word cigar all the time. Cigar. We are in the countryside. It's the summer. You hear the, the sound of the little insects singing. You, you you cannot miss it because you're Haitian, you're a human being, you have had the Haitian experience, so you would never write cicada for cigar. So be very careful when you go on those websites to offering free English to Haitian Creole translation. Now, if you want a general idea of something, Yes, you could use those websites because you don't, there is no import, there is no imp, major impact for this kind of information. But if you're trying to communicate important information to the Haitian community, it wouldn't be professional, it, couldn't, it wouldn't be fair, just and respectable to your Haitian community to go on Google or to go on, on translate.com or to go on Lingvanex or any other because they have they have almost the same pattern. You you couldn't you couldn't find it on Google Google couldn't Google couldn't translate Cicada, neither could uh, translate.com, neither could Lingvanex.com. I could go through the whole list here. You can see um, this one online transition pro. If I go for the thing, it'll be the same thing. Let's go just for the sake of doing it. Okay, because they're using almost the same um, uh, database of, of, of pre trusted co content. Okay, so once again, I'm gonna go through it. The cicada was singing the whole 
Yeah, so what? This is the first time I'm using this, this, this platform, so let's see what they're saying here. Okay, clearly this is a copy of Google. They're just copying whatever it is from Google Translate. Once again, this thing, this platform, this free platform is unable to translate the word cicada. Now, if you are Haitian like I am, you will know that cicada is not a Haitian word, period. Just that it exists in Haitian Creole. The word cicada does not exist in Haitian Creole. It's a word invented by this translation machine. It doesn't exist. Um, so I hope my review of those free English to Haitian Creole translation options, softwares and apps has been useful. And when you truly need serious translation, when you need something that you can rely on, when you need a translation from English to Haitian Creole that you, you want to share, uh, when you want to share information with the Haitian community in their own language, make sure you contact somebody like me, somebody who's actually a Haitian person who speaks English, who understands English, who understand, who also speaks Haitian Creole, obviously because it's a native speaker. And then you can be sure that the message you're trying to convey is conveyed in the most exact, in the most accurate, in the most precise way to the Haitian audience. Thank you very much for your time and attention. Uh, please leave me a like, leave a comment, okay? And until next time, thank you so much. It was Swans.